where are we right now? We are in San Francisco. We just landed. It still doesn't feel like it though. No, it doesn't. So, how was your first plane ride? Scary at first, but a lot of fun. Yeah. I'm glad we're here now. <laughs> how many coffees did you have? I had two venties. I had a bottle of tea and like two or three things of water on the plane. I really have to pee. They haven't started letting people off. We've been here for like five minutes. <laughs> <laughs> I'm secretly famous. Do you remember doing what you told? Caught in a daydream, being on your own. My soul is younger, my body's overgrown. Hold to the feeling before we get too old. I'm not like all of my friends, I'd rather get lost in conversation. Each other again. I won't let this moment slip out through my hands. No one ever know it if we had a chance. I like when we're falling. Who knows where we land? Love is what happens when you make other plans. I legit almost lost my hat. Deep in, swimming to the start. All to pretend we know where we are. How do I treat you? You deserve the best. The way you teach me to never shake again. Yes. I'm not like all of my friends. I'd rather get lost in conversation. Love is what happens when you make other plans 
take our food home. <laughs> our food baby. Hey guys, so I hope you liked my California vlog. Um, I was lucky enough to have Thomas invite me to go with him to stay with his family out there and we had a really fun time exploring. Um, I didn't get to record everything. Um, there were moments where I kind of got sucked in, which you know that's the beauty of it. Um, Hopefully you guys want to go out and see stuff for yourself, you know, and my camera can only take in so much and I can only fit so much into a video. At one point we were in Japantown and my camera died while we were staying in San Francisco and I forgot my charger. Um, so I didn't get anything from there. I have pictures from my phone and stuff. You know, since I didn't get content from Japantown, I would... Um, show you guys what I got from there and um, what I bought throughout the trip and um, yeah so one of the things I bought was this guy it's probably one of my favorite things that I got um, it's a little Yakul so soft I couldn't leave him behind we actually went back to get him because um, I fell in love with him just look at it Look at him. I've been wanting to get a kitsune mask for a while and I found this one. I love the little sakura on there and it fits pretty well with the art I have on my wall. See I also got <clears throat> some of these Palomino Blackwing pencils. Um, I've used them before. My brother got some from Chinatown in New York. Um, but when I saw them, I had to buy some more. They're really nice to sketch with. They're probably way too much washi tape. I spent a lot of money on these. Um, I use them in my sketchbooks to tape in sketches. Um, or just to add a little extra something in there. They're really nice. They, these are the packages that they came in. Um, but some of them I've already used and taken them out of the package. This one's probably my favorite one so far. Um, which is part of the reason why it's still in a package. Because I don't want to like be so inclined to use it all the time. <laughs> Look, it's got a little ghost. I love it. I also got... And this cute little magnet with a ghost on it. I got some matching socks of this as well. And a couple um, magnets with corgis on them for my brother. I also got these little good luck type charms. Um, <clears throat> this one... I believe she said, uh, supposed to bring luck for love or something along those lines. Got this one, which is supposed to bring you luck for education. Um, and since I'm still going to college right now, I thought this was pretty appropriate. So I also got two of these teacups from that same store where I got those good luck tags. You could buy uh, teapots and figurines in this store too. It was really cool. It was authentic stuff from Japan. Yeah, the lady in that store was really nice. Uh, Thomas and I talked to her for quite a bit of time. Um, I told her that I eventually wanted to move to Japan and she said that her daughter studied abroad there um, and she said it's really great and um, if I get the chance to ever go, I should, which one of these days I will. Yes. Golden Gate Bridge patch that I wear on my vest that has all my enamel pins on it. Um, I got a few postcards from this store as well and sent them out to a couple friends. I'll see you guys in the next vlog. Stay tuned. Thanks for watching. Bye.